Focus on the good things in life. When you wake up in the morning, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? Is it the list of tasks you need to do for the day? Is it the annoying thought that the heater's broken again and you're dreading the cold shower? Is it the long drive to work? Take note of the first thing that crosses your mind in the morning and notice how that first thought affects you. Does it make you look forward to the day? What we choose to think about and focus our attention to matters. It affects our feelings and disposition. And recent studies show that our thoughts also affect our body. So being irritated and anxious so early in the morning might be a bad habit to sustain. Instead of filling your head with early worries, try to look for other things to focus on. Instead of the cold shower, it could be the nice cup of coffee that you're looking forward to. Instead of the long drive to work, you can look forward to playing your favorite playlist and having more time to jam and sing along with it. Instead of worrying about tasks, think about the triumphant feeling you'll have once you check those off one by one. We can choose our thoughts and back them up with positive emotions. And before you know it, you can see more good things in life. There is plenty to be grateful for. One of the best things you can choose to see is how there really is plenty to be thankful for. Try doing this exercise. Take a piece of paper and write down all the things that you consider blessings for today. It could be as monumental as an increase in your salary, or as essential as having food on the table. You can even put an instance when a scenery or photo made you smile. List as many and as often as things come to your mind. You'll be surprised how many things you'll be able to write down. Keep doing this every day, and before you know it, you'll be full of gratitude and more and more positive things will happen to you. Pay attention to the little joys. Have you given thought to what your little joys are? What makes you smile? What do you find beautiful? These can shed light on what the little joys in your life are. When you start to take note of them, your list of good things in your life increases. This will help you increase your focus on what's abundant instead of what's lacking. But more importantly, it'll help motivate you to keep pushing for the things that you want because you don't burden yourself with frustration and negativity. What you focus on grows, so focus on the good things. When you worry, you focus your energy and attention on things that have not happened yet. And yet, worrying makes you feel like you already are in trouble or that you've already failed. Notice what your actions are when you're already worried. Are they proactive or defensive? Notice how you feel. Do you feel fulfilled or trapped? These feelings affect your actions, and the more negative actions you take, the more negative feelings are reinforced. The situation is mutually reinforcing. The good thing is that you can break that cycle. The power is in choosing to think positive thoughts. So when you wake up tomorrow, what will be your first thought?